Hi guys, Stephen here from Family Base. Um, just have another little art activity you guys can do while you're at home. Uh, I know we can't see a lot of the people that we'd really like to right now, but what we can do is maybe we can send them a little bit of a letter. So today what we're gonna do is we're gonna do cards and we're gonna do them with just a little bit of wool and paint to make them a little bit interesting. So I hope you guys enjoy. Okay guys, the first thing for this one you'll need is a little bit of wool or string and then a piece of card or paper folded up like a traditional card. I need some paint, I'll just pick three colors here, but you can use as many as you want. So lay your card down first. Get your paints close by. And what you'll want is a piece of your string or your wool for each color that you have. So just take your wool and lay it into your colors. Give them a little bit of a mix with something. I'm just using a paintbrush here just to kind of dip the wool down into the paint and get them covered. So do that with each color that you have. And when you're happy enough that you've got a good amount of paint on each of the pieces of wool, start with the first color, take it out, maybe shake off some of the extra paint and just lay it down on the inside of your card on one side. Then take the next color and do the same thing. Just kind of spread them around so that they're getting over the whole face of the card. Keep going with that until you've used all your colors and all your little pieces of wool. And just make sure you leave a little bit of the wool sticking out of the bottom of the card. And I'll show you why in a second. And then when you're done, close the card over and press it down. And then get those little tail ends of the wool that were sticking out. Get them in your hand, press down on the card with one hand, and then pull them out. Keep pressure with your other hand. And then when you open the card back up, you should see that the colors have pulled out and made a little design on each side. And you want to let that dry for a little bit. Now, what I did is I made a card for the people that maybe we're not able to see at the moment, so... And then I wrote a little message on the inside, so you can do the exact same thing. And as I said, the post office is still going for us today, so we can send that out, and maybe Nana and Grandad can see that we're still thinking about them and miss them very much. So there you go, guys. That's the wool painting card idea, so I hope you guys will give it a try. And we'll see you guys when we have another art activity for you. Bye!